Now, many parents grin and bear taking their little darlings to dance lessons, but if our first guest was teaching them, the whole experience would be worth it. He's become the breakout success of Sky One's documentary series, Pineapple Dance Studios, and his eccentric style of management has won a legion of fans. Proving he's still got it, here's a glimpse of uh, where careers are made. Dreams are broken, bitching's an Olympic sport, and everyone is fabulous. You know, just every now and then, I like to just flip around, you know, walk, <laughs> flip. Oh, dear. I've lost the pin in my Rolex. There's nothing wrong with working in Sainsbury's or Asda Packet. There's nothing wrong. But imagine me down the aisle. Right, so get in. Baby. I mean, you know, it's not going to happen, is it? Oh, oh, I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to take you up somewhere where you've never been. Do you need to get by? Oh, you want to go to the lake? Let's go. You're on. No, darling, it's through that way. Yeah, no, don't pee on the fire escape. That's just a cat. <laughs> Please welcome Louis Spence. <laughs> Told I can't kiss you so it cuts into my time, but you give me one. Oh, no, you're right, darling. You could turn me with that moustache. <laughs> <laughs> really, it's not with a mine. Look out. <laughs> You shouldn't have pinned, darling. When I see you on air, that colour's yeah. gorgeous, and I loved your cleavage. It Did was gorgeous. You? Absolutely. Oh, all right, no, then. No, absolutely. It's all way always out, darling. That's not bad. It's not at oh, all. Have you been shaving? No, because now I see what you're oh. saying about the hair removal cream. Yes, yes. And no, I don't shave. I do once a week from here to here, mm. and then every three months to rear. But <laughs> the thing is, you've got to know how long to leave it on. You yeah, only yeah. leave it on for, they say like seven minutes, I do six. Although I can't say six or seven, I do six. <laughs> but, and also, also, if you are going to do anywhere sensitive, like your man bag or anything, because I'm sure that's what's been burnt, right? Three minutes. Three minutes. Three what minutes and no it? more. But I, I don't, I don't, I does don't. Does it make it go rough? No, no it doesn't, right, you actually. see, because it doesn't take it right from the root. Like, when you wax it, as you would know, if you girls do your Brazilians yeah. and whatever. No. If you wax it, it goes right from the root. With the hair removal cream, it just takes it down just to the surface of the skin. So, literally, this is, I'm Saturday, I do. And look, so, I mean, you can feel, it's not that rather feel. No, it's all right, actually. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, you, we get, like, you can get beard rash. Do you get, people get, like, chest rash? No. No, no, I don't. But isn't it That's a bit nice. velcro? So when you go by somewhere, you go, you stick to something like that. Well, darling, you know what? If they're cute, I don't mind sticking to them. That's all I have. I have to walk by when I'm in Sainsbury's or... Oh, I can't say that, can I have said it? Anyway, oh, <laughs> wherever I am shopping, I'll often walk by and I'll still be sticking on them. You know? But no, it doesn't. And, you, and only, only if you wear a really thin fabric, you can see the stubble coming through. Yeah. But you've just got to be careful when You're you do You're so it. flexible, though, aren't you? Mm, You're going to yeah, have yeah. to show us a bit of your movements. <laughs> what do you... What, what, do you, move, what movements do you want, oh, darling? Anything. <laughs> <laughs> anything. Can you show... Because that's what you've become famous for, Come Louis. on, let's see I mean, it. don't push me. <laughs> <laughs> really. Now, listen. I know it's always the same thing I seem to do, because I'm not warmed up, so it's just this one thing I can always do without being warmed up. Right. right. right I've got my phone on me, because I'm really busy now, right, darling. I'll, I'll I don't want to miss a thing. No, I don't want to miss I'll a trip. Hello. Yeah. 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 Hold on. So, and also, I popped my hamstring recently, so... And I did nice little stretch. <laughs> Oh, I'm ringing. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's all right. It's all right. I won't do him on air. Can, can I ask you something? Yeah. Uh, were you this shy and retiring before you became huge and fabulous, darling? Um, I've always been this way. Have you? I mean, I really have. I mean, this is the thing. When people have watched the show, they've said, you know, are there actors? There's people like myself and Andrew and Trish and... But no. I mean, this is me. You, you know, went to a stage school, didn't you? I went to contest. So did I. I went to contest. And there were lots of boys like you there. Babe, there was loads of... <laughs> I mean, literally, one thing I found out when I was 12, it was fine to be gay. Do you know what I mean? I, was, I went to school and they were all gay. I was you like, great. Are? <laughs> found heaven. Sorry, <laughs> Like you, I'm, oh, no, I'm sorry. no, you're right there, Sherry. No, they can't. can't. I'm pretty unique. And you haven't changed, but no. your life has changed, hasn't it? Well, yeah, my life is changing. Yeah. I mean, well, in saying that, the only thing that's different is, is the fact that now there's a lot of media attention on me and pictures are being taken of me in that way. But I've known... Do you like it? Um, 
I, I mean, it's fun. I'm having so much fun with it. I have seen this happen before. I mean, when I did the Spice Girls World Tour, hanging out with all those girls, yes. and as everyone knows, because I always go on about how much I love Emma Bunton, she's like my best friend. And, um, yeah, it's not because she buys me gorgeous gifts. No. It's not. <laughs> but, you know, I, there's many times I went to Jonathan Ross with her, I went to MTV Awards, I went lots of free holidays with her. Um, <laughs> but, you know, I did lots of things with her, so I see how the media were, was with her. Yeah, yeah. And I was always that person in the background. And but now, now the attention's just focused on me. So I really am just having so much fun yeah. with it. And what's happening is, is really good. But this is show business, and you know, like your flavour for now, and then next year you may not be. Mm, yeah. Yeah. And you know, but and you're, that's you're like an overnight success. But it actually, you've been doing what Since you I was do five, exactly. Yeah. So it's you've put in the training yeah. and the, the background. Yeah, and I mean, I worked really, really hard. I mean, I was, I was so dedicated to dance. I mean, when I did it, it was, you know, it's mm. the only one thing I do take seriously is dance. I mean, I don't dance professionally anymore, but it's the one thing which is yeah. a true love, and I know that I shone. It was my thing that I could do. Yeah. You know, I couldn't spell, you know, I mean, I could read enough, you know, I could add up enough to know how much money I'm getting. That's all but, you, you know, need to know. Exactly. <laughs> Louis, can I, yeah. Obviously, you know, we, we've talked about the show itself has, has changed your life. Is the last, last episode coming up on Sunday, isn't it? Well, the last episode's always been, already been. What they're doing is, I mean, they're ringing it out, darling. It's, um, <laughs> it's the outtakes. Oh, so, oh fantastic. Oh, darling, I don't know I if it is so it, fantastic. I, yeah. I mean, a little, we are a little bit worried about that. Why? I don't know if they'll be able to air it at the same time. It went a bit beyond watershed, darling. I mean, really. I mean, you know, it got a little bit racy, like, at six o'clock. But honestly, some of the things they took out, I'm not surprised it's on the cutting room floor. It's where it should be on the so floor. What, what, so what, what, are you, what are you going to do now, now the series is finished? Well, I'm doing pantomime at Christmas. Oh. I'm in Wimbledon. Look at me in London. Yes, I'm doing, yeah. I'm doing um, Peter Pan, and I'm not Wendy, and I'm not, <laughs> and I'm not Tinkerbell. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a butch pirate. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, I think so. <laughs> Louis, come and see us before Christmas. We can't no, wait that long. Absolutely. No, I will. Can I just say, if you're going to kick me off, yes. I've got to say hello to my mum. She works at an old people's home and she's meant to be feeding them, but she doesn't right. feed them because she always sits and watches this show. <laughs> so, all those poor old people are actually starving at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm so, Pat! <laughs> yeah. Feed them old ladies. It's Louis' birthday.